Go ahead. Look, look. Come right here, bro. Come right here. No, I don't need to. Because guess what? You right here. My, my back is turned. You're about to lose my attention. I have you look. Go you ahead, have two bro. people with two degrees. Guess what? Right. Guess what? I respect what you guys are doing. Right. But I'm going to ask you a question. Go ahead, bro. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Right ho, ho. You asked me a question, I'm going to ask you, right? Not, 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 not with a parent, but it's a state. Come both of them slaves down his eyes, right? Wrong. You said what? Wrong, sir. Now, now, if you if we brothers, oh, we're going to be like men. Give me Jeremiah 14 and 2. Who are the real Jews according to the Bible, brother? Everything took place in Mississippi. Everything took place in Mississippi. Mississippi. Right. 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 You can talk to me like a man. Now. But guess what? I'm, I'm not I'm yeah, out here for you, brother. I'm out here for all of our people. Yeah, I want the other brothers to hear as well. Yeah, bro. So watch this, brother. Yeah. Let's yeah. deal with all the respect. We right? both have political degrees. I'm not worried about I'm out here trying to uh, show you how smart I am. I'm hey, giving God's yeah. words. So watch this. What I'm saying is you are really tough. Look, you are really tough. Jeremiah 14 to read that, man. The book, of Jer the book of Jeremiah. Chapter 14 and verse 2. Hold on, first Come on, wait it now. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Are you hold on, hold on. Yeah, yeah. You hold on. I haven't asked for anything yet. You I haven't asked for anything yet, brother. This is what I'm trying to tell you. So listen, all the world, all my eyes are done. The reason I speak on this loud speaker because I want everybody to be edified. So now, the question is, he said, is, is your wife? My wife. I'm asking his wife, right? My wife. I, his wife. I said it once. I didn't even say right. his wife. So I'm asking, he said, he said, Jewish, right? Jewish, right? So who are the real Jews? Read that. The book of who are the real Jews? Hey, Watch this, read that. Who are the real Negroes? We are the Negroes. Negro. Are you sure? Are you yes. sure? Yes, sir. Because the way you two are, look, you know what the one thing that Negroes uh -huh. did let happen? What's that? They communicated and they loved the people's time. What Jews did that? No, I said what niggas did that. I didn't say oh, Jews. we're not niggas. What huh? Negroes did that? You won't let me get a chance to goddamn communicate you with you, brother? You ask me a question, you won't let me answer, bro. No, bro, you are trying to communicate with me on something that I'm not only speaking to you, brother. I'm out here for the message. I'm asking you for your attention. But I don't speak with my own words, bro. Like you, I use the Bible. Guess, guess what? Read that. What you're doing, and what you're doing, read. is you're being fugazi. The book of Jeremiah. Hey, watch this, watch this. Read you're that. being fugazi. Chapter 14 and verse 2. Come on. Hey, bro. It says, do the mourner. I'm more Bible than this nigga Judah ever Judah mourner. I'm more Bible than this nigga and ever be. And they of language. Uh -huh. They are black into the ground. They are hope. They are black into the ground. The real Jews are what color? Hey, are black into the ground. The real Jews hey, are black, bro. Hey, guess what? The real Jews are black, bro. I'm asking a question. She's not Jewish. Jewish. Oh, wait, no, 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 I'm asking a question. Go ahead. Go ahead. What God give out? Give it. Hey, give it. See? Man, do God real. Do God Second answer, 654. Let me tell you something, man. Our people don't believe in this Bible, man. They want to do what they want to do. do but we're going to do what God do. We're going to do what God do. That's right. Watch this. Do what Let's God, do what God says you. about these other things. It's talking about the name of Jesus. The book of, it's talking about the name of Jesus. Watch man. this. We're bringing out the Bible, the real testimony of Jesus Christ, man. We're going to tell you the truth according to the Bible. Let's talk about the name of Jesus, our people, man. Our people don't want to hear the laws, man. Our people don't want to hear God's word. They want to hear me and the In the name of Jesus. Come on, read that. The book of 2nd Ephesus, chapter 6 and verse 54. And after these, Adam also, whom thou madest Lord of all thy creatures, of him come we all. Of him come we all. Come on. Come on. And after these, Adam also, whom thou madest Lord of all thy creatures, That's right. of him come we all. Come on. And the people whom thou hast chosen. Uh -huh. All this have I spoken before thee. Oh Lord, because thou made us the world for our sakes. He made the world for our sakes. Man, the Israelites, come on. Don't let Satan stop As for the other people, as for the other people, we don't. Which also come of Adam. The other nations that come from Adam, come on. Thou hast said that they are nothing. But God said they are what? That they Nathan. are nothing. They are nothing compared to the Israelites from the 12 tribes of Israel. You are an Israelite. God said you are above the nations. We don't. But be like unto spittle. They be like unto what? Unto 
lights on spittle. God said the other nations are lights on spittle compared to you. Come on. And has like that are burning the them until it drops their fall from a vessel. They are likened to an abundance. If you have a big glass of water and a little bit fall out, that's how God looked at the other nations. He said, you are better than that. Come on. And now, O oh Lord, behold these heathens, which have ever been reputed as nothing. But he want to tell me something about his, his wife, so-called wife. They nation put us into bondage. Give me Deuteronomy 28, 16. Let me show you what, what he care about his altar. First off, give me first Maccabees. Uh, 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 4 and 15, man. I guess from, uh, uh, the, uh, the, uh, you know what I'm talking about. You got the traitor, the, uh, the one who, the Grecian is likened to Grecian of all. You got the second Maccabees 4 and 15. Second Maccabees 4 and 15, that's what it is. You gotta do God will. You gotta do God will. 4 and 15. Maybe 4 and 15, or 3 and 15. Yeah, read that, that's what I want. The book of second Maccabees chapter 4 and verse 15. Not suddenly by the honors of their fathers. See, they ain't selling by the honors of their father. Like, you're my father. I'm going to keep our lineage going. I'm going to do what my daddy did. Marrying my own people. They ain't doing that. He want to marry his enemy. The people who blocked his people up and killed his people. David. Come on. Slavery. But liking the glory of the Grecians best of all. They liking to the glory of the Grecians best of all. Is that it on there? It says, by reason, while well, some calamity came upon them. For they had them to be their enemies and avengers. See, he want to save his enemy. They was his enemy, they didn't kill his people. But now he want to talk about her Jewish background. You're not the real Jews. The real Jews is the, the tribe of Judah. That's us. The so-called black man. He don't know what he's talking about. I, I don't know what. He's trying to talk about what his wife did. See, this true hurt. They do. It hurt when you hear the truth. We have been lied to. We have been deceived by philosophies of men. Give me that. Elijah, man. We've been slaves. We've been beat. This ideology been beat into us, big brother. Christ is a black man, but they hang up this white Jesus. Where they get that man from, man? Where they get that man from? I came out here to the streets just for you, brother. Go where God told you. I came out here just for you. Get him on up, man. Listen. Hey, where God told you. Book of Colossians, chapter 2 and verse 8. But what? You got this same man spoil you through philosophy and vain deceit. See, we ain't out here to hear your opinion. We giving you straight facts out of the Bible, man. People don't want to hear the Bible come out. They go to Sunday church and wait on them lies. We ain't giving you no lies. We're giving you thus self the Lord God. Read that again. The book of Colossians, chapter 2 and verse 8. Go on, lest any man spoil you through philosophy and vain deceit. And vain deceit. We have been deceived, y'all. Let me tell you that all is created equal. That is a lie. Come on. After the traditions of men. After the traditions of men. Go ahead. After the rudiments of the world. God said, don't be conformed to this world. But they're telling you lies based off what the world thinks. Come on. And not after Christ. And not after the black Messiah. They ain't telling you according to what he said. Do you believe on Christ, brother? Yeah. All right, check this out. John 7 and 38. So we ain't going to believe what pastors say. What are we going to believe? That's what right. God say. Right. We're going to believe after scriptures say right or wrong. That, that, that's right there. That's true. So we ain't going to sit here and like, well, I feel, well, I feel like this, I feel like, no. Me and you, we don't die off, off the scriptures because we believe as the scriptures. Heart, in my heart. Right there. Read that. The book of John, chapter 7 and verse 38. Sister, our people out here believing into all these pastors, but we need to believe on what God says in this book. Come on. He that believeth on me, as the scripture have said. As the what? As the scripture have said. As the, out of my own mouth. As the scripture have said. Mm. Out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. See that? We believe as these as these scriptures have said. And you say it what, man? You definitely God to you. That's why we out here, big brother. That's why our brother came out here. I gotta I gotta let you know something though, big brother. What we out here doing is we're showing our people their transgressions. We gotta correct each other. Isaiah 58 and 1. We, one, man. Right. So when we're saving them, we actually saving them from death, big brother. The word. You the word. That's what we out here. That's why we out here. So we out here to correct our brothers in righteousness. We out here to judge each other. See, if I was out here 
shooting at my home, my friends. Yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. The devil will let it. Right? Yeah, but yeah. I'm breaking God's law. It's our job as men of the Lord to correct each other when we see that wrong. So when we see our wrong, people being wrong and in error, we're supposed to correct it. But we can't be hypocrites. We gotta be living and keeping the laws ourselves. Read that. Book of Isaiah, chapter 58 and verse 1. Come on. Cry aloud. Cry aloud. That's why we crying aloud right now, big brother. Not just speaking loud with a microphone, but we're trying to reach all of our people. Whoever wanna hear it, but you're the only one who hear it. Come on, we don't spare not. We're not sparing our brother's feelings, because the truth hurts sometimes. But we're gonna give it to you because it's medicine for you. It's gonna heal you. Come on. Come on. Lift Ooh. up thy voice like a trump. That's why we out here screaming with a microphone. It said, lift up thy voice like a trumpet. A trumpet is loud. Come on. And show my people their transgressions. See, we out here show our people their transgressions, their sins. So we can get into the kingdom. That's the only way we get into the kingdom if we keep God's commandments. You can believe all day. Faith without works is what? What, yeah. brother? What? Yeah. Exactly. So that means I got to use my faith and keep God's law. I can't be out here robbing folks, smoking weed, having sex with these sisters and impregnating them and don't take care of the kids. We got to believe as the scriptures have said. Matthew 19, 16. This is how we get into the kingdom. The kingdom is only for us. That's why I'm out here to give you the truth. It is time to wake up out of our sleep. I love you, brother. Hit this out real quick. This for you. That's why I'm glad I even came out here tonight. Just to see you. Just to see you. Them tears of joy right now. Because guess what? God said you're special. Give me Deuteronomy 76 real quick. This for you, big brother. I'm your kinsman. I'm your brethren. According to the flesh. Only the most high God words can heal you right now. And watch this, big brother. Let me get this scripture. Deuteronomy 7 and verse 6. Let me show you how special it is according to the Bible. According to the most high God. Watch this, brother. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 7 and verse 6. For thou art an holy people. You heard that? God said you are holy people. Holy. Set apart people. Come on. Unto the Lord thy God. The Lord thy God hath chosen thee. He did what? The Lord thy God hath chosen thee. Out of all these people walking around these streets, out of all these nations in the whole entire world, God chose the Israelites as a holy people. Which who you are, brother. Come on. To be a special people. We are special people. The Israelites, you blacks, Hispanics, whose father is Negro and Indian descent. You are special according to the Most High God. You are chosen. Come on. Unto himself, above all people that are upon the face of the earth. You heard that, big brother? Get up. Stand up. God wants you to stand up like a man. Stand up. You're special. I'm a man of God, kneel down. You stand up. That's right. It's time to repent. It's time to repent, brother. It's time to repent, bro. It's time to repent. You're the man of the Lord, special. Give me Romans 13 and 4, man. No, give me Romans 15 and 4, sorry. See these scriptures for our learning, brother. It's for us to learn. It's for us to learn from. Come on. The book of Romans, chapter 15 and verse 4. For whatsoever things were written or for time, see, they were written before we was in the hill. Come on. We're written for our learning. They were written for what? Our learning. Come on. That we, through patience and comfort of the scriptures, see, comfort of the scriptures. That's what's going to get you right. Come on. Might have hope. Might have hope. We're trying to get our situation better. The only way you do that, brother, is you keep God's commandments. You want good success? You gotta keep God's commandments. You wanna live a better life? You gotta keep God's commandments. If you say you love God, you gotta keep God's commandments. That's what we have to do. He requires some of you. Give me that in Joshua 1 and 8 real quick. Come on. The book of Joshua, chapter 1 and verse 8. See, we are here for our people. You blacks, so-called black. Black is only a color. Read that, man. The book of Joshua, chapter 1 and verse 8. Come on. This book of the law shall not depart out of thy mouth. See, big brother, we got to keep telling each other these laws. Because we're seen to forget them. This world is so, 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 it's on us so much. We'll forget them. Every time we see something that look good, we'll forget God's laws. That's why you're supposed to meditate in these laws. 
Think about these laws every day. Talk about these laws day in, day and night. Go on, read on. But thou shalt meditate therein day and night, and thou mayest observe to do according to all that is written therein. For then thou shalt make thy way prosperous, and then thou shalt have good success. See, you want to be prosperous? You want to have good success? You got to keep God's commandments. You have to follow Christ as it is written in this Bible. Deuteronomy 10 and 12, last verse. What the Bible calls you? You are an Israelite. Now what? Because guess what, big brother? I was out here just like you. I was out here just, just like these Negroes. Buying cigarettes, smoking, selling dope, robbing folk, sleeping with all type of women, catching all, uh, all type of diseases. Been to the clinic 100,000 times. See, I had to go through that just to learn something. Had to learn something. Through that affliction, you're going to learn something. Give me that one night, uh, what do you got on? Give me that. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 10 and verse 12. And now, Israel, what does the Lord thy God require of thee? You hear that? It's time to get away from that old life. Now somebody requires some of you, the most high God. Read that. But to fear the Lord thy God. To do what? But to fear the Lord thy God. You fear him, meaning you respect him. You do what you're told. Read on. To walk in all his ways. To do what? To walk in all his ways. I'm going to do what I want to do. To walk in all his ways. I'm going to smoke weed when I want to smoke weed. To walk in all his ways. I'm going to do what I want to do. To walk in all his ways. Do it. And to love him. Do what? And to love him. See, everybody said they claim they love Jesus. He died for my sins. Well, why you ain't showing that love back? Come on, read on. And to serve the Lord thy God with all thy heart and with all thy soul. To keep the commandments of the Lord. To do what? To keep the commandments of the Lord. See, it's all about keeping God's commandments, man. You got to keep God's commandments, bro. It's time to 